Um, the recovery is something I'm still working on. Um, you know, my strength is obviously a big thing for me right now, but uh, I'm working to get back, and I thought, I thought it was a good start today. Did you expect to play that much? No, I didn't. I did not. Um, I thought I'd get a couple minutes here and there. I didn't expect to play that much in the second half. I knew, well, I guess I didn't know, but I thought I'd go in a little bit in the first half, get a bowl break, and then same in the second half. But he left me in there in the second half because we were just playing zone and um, you know, pushing it fast break. So I thought I could you know, play good and push it a little bit. So How hard has this been for you not being able to play? Um, you know, it, it's tough. Um, Watching you know, the team, you know, just wanting to wanting to do something. You know, I want to help in any way that I can, um, and I haven't even practiced in either. So, uh, practice three days now. So, getting back to hopefully where I can be effective. But. How long do you think that'll be before you? And there's really no way to know, is there? No, you know. I, I hope it's soon, but I don't know for sure. Um, you know, they, there's different there's varying lengths of how long they say it can kind of linger. So I guess it, we just kind of have to see how it goes. And I'll keep, I'll keep lifting. I'll keep working out. I'll work on my conditioning. I'll, you know, I'll keep going, and we'll see, we'll see how it goes. I don't know. We had a lot of losses, so we're just gonna keep it up. How were you guys able to decrease the turnovers? I know that's been a sore spot lately. Uh, just being more focused, being, you know, not having too many mental breakdowns, being more careful with the ball. You guys seem to be more patient, especially getting the ball into the post and working inside out. Did you feel like that was a work for you guys well today? Yeah, definitely. Uh, we worked on a lot in practice, being spaced out, uh, moving the ball around the perimeter, keeping TC in the post. How did you feel like Connor played through his first college first, first game? game? I think I thought he played really good. Uh, he's been doing great in practice. Uh, he's been going hard, so he's going to be great. What can this game do for you guys? Now you got a full week here to get ready for Drake finals, things like that. Uh, just motivate us to, you know, it feels good to win again. So just motivate us. Remember this feeling and just go hard. Main reasons that this team was able to pull away late in the first half and into the second half. Uh, how, how do you feel about your performance today, and how did it feel to kind of be back and? Playing big minutes, getting big points, rebounds. Oh, yeah. uh, I mean, it just feels great to win. Uh, you know, it, it felt good out there. You know, I just tried to come off the bench and get some energy. Uh, you know, we switched the starting lineup up, and then you know that doesn't change my mentality. So I, I came out there with some energy, try to give us a boost. You know, we came out a little bit, a little bit flat. You know, you couldn't get any separation from. Them, so I just try to, you know, come out there, get on the glass, uh, get some energy, and uh, get us on a run. And I think after that, our whole uh, our whole team did a good job of keeping consistent and keeping building on the lead, building on the lead, and this is. It has been a struggle for us, so it was good to see that. From a confidence perspective, how important was tonight for you? Oh uh, yeah, it was great. You know, uh, especially free throws. You know, uh, I've always been a good free throw shooter, so stepping up there and finally hitting a couple, you know, uh, definitely boosted my confidence. And you know, uh, I, I understand my ability. I know I can do it. So I just got to keep out there, keep going with the energy. You know, everything will fall into place. You really started to feel it there when you hit that three. Oh yeah, for sure. That was a big moment for you. Yeah, for sure. You know, I just ran up there, and uh, you know, it wasn't a. I didn't think at all. You know, I just didn't hesitate, and I was just feeling good. And, uh, not starting the way I know you want to? Uh, yeah, I don't let it bother me too much. Uh, I come in and shoot every day, and uh, I know eventually, I know I was in a slump before, but eventually they're going to start falling. And, like how they do in practice, I just got to transfer that over to the game. When you hit that first one, Michael, like, oh, that, that really helped you in the game? Like, yeah, it did. It did. It helped me with uh, not really my confidence, but just like, I don't know, we got like everybody on the team going, like, okay, make it fine. Like, we're all. Like, I don't really not explain it, but it did help a lot. You, where, where does your confidence coming from? I mean, after you know not getting to play for a while, and all of a sudden you're playing. Right. You never lost hope. Where did that Where did that come from? Uh, probably just uh, the people closest to me, just telling me just to stay focused on what my long term goal is, and like, just to be the best player I can be. And I just bought into that and bought into listening to them. And, um, and now I'm uh, getting a chance to show what I can do.